This build of RSpec has some nice features to help you work with measured spectrums. Here I'm going to use the wheel on the top of my mouse to zoom in on a feature and then control shift to frame it in so that we can see it clearly on the display. Now I'll put a checkbox here on show lines. As usual, the measure lines appear. If I hold down the shift key and move one measure line, the other measure line moves along with it as we're seeing here. So to bracket in a feature to measure it, I move the line so that they're equidistant on either side of the feature. Now that can be tricky to adjust, and if it's not done right, the measurements aren't going to be accurate. Here I'm carefully trying to move that left measure line so that it intersects the graph at the same spot as the right measure line. You've got to do that to be accurate. So here's the new feature. If I hold the control key down, when I move one measure line, our spec will move the other measure line so that it intersects the graph at the same y-axis value. Here you can see RSpec making sure that the measure lines always intersect my profile graph at the same spot. This will mean very accurate measurements. Also, when the measure lines are showing, we now, in addition to showing the pixels or angstroms on the left here, will show that 1358, which is the y-axis value. That can help you when you're working with your measurements and want to do some calculations. To show you this final improvement in this build, I flipped over to a static JPEG image. And I'm going to go over and turn off averaging. That will make it easier to see what's going on. This new feature is on the toolbar, and it's horizontal spectrum binning. This feature will combine adjacent pixels, averaging them. In some hardware or scene conditions, that can dramatically improve the quality of your image and the resulting profile. Here, when I select to bin six adjacent pixels, we can see over on the right a much smoother profile graph. Let's turn that off, and you can see again, there's the original. So binning can really improve the quality of your images. And finally, once you've calibrated your profile, once again, RSpec will be showing your angstroms per pixel in this spot. In some previous releases, this label was omitted.